Police and the military are attempting to put an end to sit at home orders in the Southeast. Welcome to the news end. Thank you for tuning in to listen. The Assistant Inspector General of Police in charge of Zone 13, Ubo, Mr. Omar Amori, has said that the police commands in Anambra and Inigo State, together with the Nigerian Army, are working together at the end of the observation of sit at home orders in the state. Although the police boss spoke about the two states under his control, sources said that similar efforts we are being made by other commands to ensure that an end is put to the observation of sit at home in the southwest region. Well, people are beginning to come out and say, look, this sit at home is causing problem. And if you look at it, it is. People are being harassed. There is a particular video I saw, sincerely, if you see how these people are being brutalized, like... They were they they, they, they they flog people, they throw away people's wares, the same people you swear to protect, and this, the same people you swear to liberate. You took a note to liberate. They throw away people's wares, people had any money. You don't know if it is their last money. They said, okay, let me use this one and buy this and resell it and get what me and my family we used to eat. You did not think about it. Some will come. Okay, we read in the news as at the, the last sit at home they had, that is on, I think, on Monday last week. Yes, Monday last week, where a certain man, he came out for for reason known to him, came out and he was trying to make an intimate. Maybe he was even trying to do something and rushed back home. Unfortunately, these people caught him and sincerely they beat him up. And at the end of the day, they burnt that particular tricycle. You don't know if he borrowed who did if he took a loan to get it. Sincerely. A lot of things. So, this is at home. It should stop. And of course, the federal government should tow the part of dialogue. Everything. The security forces that have been sent down to the southeastern region themselves to ensure that this particular situation stops. Because the brutality that comes alongside with those who even go out, who go out to look for what they are going to eat and not stay indoors as demanded by, I don't know if it is the IPOP now or these people who are enforcing the city at home. You don't want to be caught, like, you don't want to be caught. Videos and pictures are out there on the internet showing how brutal those people can be once they find out that you're outside. On the sit at home day, no, it's not funny. I just hope that um, whatever this is, this monster that has been created by the indigenous people of Biafra, that whatever it is, something is done to it before it causes another incidence in the region. Okay, on this note, you have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for tuning in to listen. Until I come your way next time, enjoy the rest of your day.